Monsieur Pernod is coming over with a nasty skin infection. You've got to see it, and I'm going to show you how to fix it. Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. Before we get going in this video, I want to tell you about my new inner circle where I'm doing weekly Q&A live streams. Click the link in the box below for more information. Monsieur Parnot is a very friendly and exuberant Airedale. He's going to be coming over shortly. I saw him on this weekend at a soccer tournament. He's got this really nasty skin infection hotspot that his owner thought she was treating correctly, but not. And I think many of you may have the same issue. So he's going to be over here now. I'm going to show you exactly how you need to be treating this on your own dog at home. You'll never guess who just showed up and who's behind the door. So there's this hot spot there. You can see it's oozy, moist. There's still, it's quite matted with hair and there's a fair amount of sort of pasta perlite and debris all over it. So the first thing I'm going to do is just spray on a little local anesthetic just to numb it out. Here's some of the lidocaine. I'm just going to squirt that on topically. Now that the anesthetic's kicked in, I'm, we're now going to attempt to clip it and clean it. So the big thing is you need to have some proper clippers such as these here and you need to get really close to the skin, getting all that hair off so then you can get all the pus out and stop that hot spot from continuing this cycle. Oh boy. Oh, good boy. Oh. Oh, sorry. Oh. Poor guy. Who did that to you? So now I'm going to use this, it's called a hexidine flush. So the actual name of the antiseptic is chlorhexidine. You guys can pick that up at your veterinarian or any pharmacy. Good boy. So I've just got some little two by two gauzes and I'm going to make those. Good boy. And this is the, the concentrated chlorhexidine as a soap. So we're going to scrub it up to get rid of the bacteria and then wipe that off again with water. Good boy. Okay. The most important home remedy that I've found to treat a hot spot is teen aspirin. But we're going to be doing this slightly differently, making it more effective. So we're going to use this one cup of water, then this black tea bag, So this here is this tea mixture after about 15 or 20 minutes of simmering. It's a nice concentrated dark color. It's probably down to about three tablespoons, which is about a Then I'm gonna take one regular strength, 325 milligram aspirin. There's the aspirin with the hot tea. It's melting. Appears it's not quite so easy to dissolve the aspirin. So you're just gonna have to bust it up with a spoon or something. So here is our black tea, our aspirin, about our three tablespoons of concoction. We're gonna let. <laughs> so now that it's just a matter of putting on the topical tea and aspirin. The other thing you can do, and I'm gonna do Monsieur Parno, is I'm gonna add in 10 drops of this tea tree oil. So it's the Young Living Tea Tree. It's also a really good antiseptic and it's just going to sort of speed up eliminating those bacteria. So you can just use a little 2x2 two two gauze or even if you just have a clean cloth, that's fine. Just going to soak that here and then we're going to wipe that on Monsieur Perno. And we're going to be doing that four times a day for somewhere between five to seven days. So here's the tea tree, tea and aspirin. Come on. 
combination. So you can keep that mixture in the fridge, let it warm up before you apply it. It'll probably last you somewhere between five to seven days and that's completely fine. Thank you so much for watching this edition of Venerate Secret. I'd love for you to click down there and like this video. You gotta like Monsieur Perno. Click up there to subscribe to my channel. And lastly, if you've yet to do so, I'd love you to click the link in the box below. When you do that and you sign up for my newsletter, I can send you my free books and my free videos on how to heal your pets at home with my top natural remedies.